Mm. Why does that sound? Sounds so good. Hey guys, it's Candy. Welcome back to Our Family Nest. So for today's video, I thought it would be super fun to share with you an unboxing of my new iMac computer. This is the 24 inch, let me get this exactly correct, 24 inch pink iMac with 4.5K retina display. And here's the configuration, because here was my biggest thing when I knew when the new iMacs came out and they were offered in a variety of all these colors. Like, okay, no question about it. I knew I wanted the pink, although the blue was really pretty, the orange was so pretty, but I already have a lot of pink here in my office, so I was like, this is gonna look the best. I haven't had a desktop computer since probably, I don't know, 10, 12, 13 years, something like that. Normally I buy laptops so that way I can work in various areas of my home, but I'm super excited to have a desktop computer. I'll probably still use my laptop as well, but I just wanted a computer here in my office. So the biggest problem I always have when it comes to getting a new computer is like, what should I upgrade? What is not worth it? Should I just do like the best of everything and call it a day or what? So this is the configuration that I ended up getting. It is the Apple M1 chip with the eight core CPU with four performance cores. I had the 16 gigabyte unified memory. I had the two terabyte SSD storage. I did upgrade the storage. I got the magic mouse and the magic trackpad because I could not decide which to get. And I also upgraded the keyboard and got the magic keyboard with touch ID and the numeric keypad because I do a lot of accounting and stuff on my computer. And with the laptop, you never have that keypad, but with desktop computers, you have a little keyboard on the right hand side and you're you know, doing your numbers. I'm one of those people. So I'm like, yes, I need the keypad. All right, so here is the box. As if you haven't already been looking at it already, here's the beautiful, what the front of the computer is going to look like. And then I just wanted to show you on the back, they show what the back of the computer is going to look like. And it's more of like a red color, which I don't exactly love. Like why don't they just make the whole thing pink? Like most people just want pink, right? But whatever, maybe some people did buy this because they like red, who knows? So yeah, they have yellow, green, blue, purple, orange. So if you were to get one of these babies, I want you to comment down below what color you would pick out. And you might even have to go to Apple's website and see all the options because they're all kind of more like a pastel front with a little bit darker back. So you'll have to check it out. So. Have the keyboard see that numeric keyboard i love that we have the power cord okay i think that's everything so i'm gonna close this up and move this box out of the way this is so light like i don't even know what to compare it to it's probably like Seven pounds would be my guess. I'm gonna have to look it up. Maybe, maybe eight pounds. Now we need to unwrap everything. We're gonna reveal what the back looks like. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, it's still got a sticker on it. More things to unpeel. actually really love the back. I thought it was going to be like red red, but it's kind of like a berry red. Now the front, we have some more peeling to do. That is the whole 
front. Wow, I love this pink color. It's literally gorgeous. And then like the, this part right here, it's like a rose gold. That is so cool. And then the sides is where it turns the darker red. But all this right here, still rose gold. The apple's rose gold. Here's the power button in the back. And then we have the Thunderbolt ports. Plugs in right here for power. Oh my God, I love it. All right, so here's the mouse. It is white on the front and the rose gold in the back. Love that. Oh, so this is the bottom of the trackpad with the little pads in the corners and it's white on the bottom. And then it is the rose gold on the sides but then white on the top. Keyboard, I love rose gold, white keys. It has the uh, touch pad here so you can unlock your computer with your fingerprint. That's super cool. And then the back is white with the four pads for your desk. And then here we just have like the power cords. So I'll unwrap all of those. And then in here, we have like a little booklet and then a rose gold apple and a red apple. That's super cool. Oh, this is the plug that goes in the back. How cool that the plug that goes into the back of the computer is matching as well. So they make it pink with a little red outlet. Oh, so that's where the ethernet cable would plug in. And then this plugs into here. Okay, so that's nice. Means my desk is in the middle of the room. Technically, I could plug ethernet cable up to it, which I probably will do, because I have it, that cabinet back there, you can see with the plants on it, I have an ethernet cable back there. So I could plug that into here, plug this into the wall, and my computer will be even faster because it will be hardwired. Here we go. Okay. We're gonna turn this baby on. Why does that sound, sound so good? I feel like I will probably, oh, it's telling me to turn, look at that. It's telling me to turn this on. Telling me to turn, oh, the keyboard switch on. Thank you, Apple computer. Oh, it's so cute. Look how the screen is pink. I'm in love. Hmm. Ooh, what's this? This is something like a launch pad. Oh, cool. So I think I'm gonna wrap up this video right here. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this and you found it educational and inspiring to maybe purchase your own new iMac computer. Um, I do love the way it looks. I will say that. We will see how it functions. I have a lot of stuff to set up, things to transfer over to get this up and running before I'm actually using this like full time. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I want you to comment down below if you want me to go ahead and maybe like a couple weeks from now, share a video with you guys showing you like what is on my iMac computer, any apps that I decide to download that maybe um, are kind of new. I heard that there's a whole section in the app store of like games and different things that are like optimized for the use on an iMac computer. So I'm gonna check those out. I actually made note of some apps that I want to check out to um, uh, help with like business related things and stuff too. So let me know if you guys wanna see that in any future videos. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thumbs it up if you enjoyed it. You can ask me any questions that you would like to down below in the comments as well. And yeah, that's it guys, that's a wrap. So see you next time, bye guys.